Hello, and welcome to this video on space gas with simple English. This fourth video will teach you how to analyze your model. Here, we can see the nodes, the member, and the forces from the last videos. To analyze the model, we can click on Analysis and Linear Static Analysis. But there is a problem. We need to tell SpaceGas how to model the supports for the member. We want this beam to be simply supported. The beam can rotate at the supports, but it cannot move up or down. At this roller support, the beam can move left and right. We can add these supports to our model in SpaceGas. We can click on Structure, then Node Restraints, and data sheet. We can add a restraint to node 1. And we want node 1 to be a pin. The beam can rotate but not move here. Now we have this restraint code FFFFR R. What does this mean? The first three letters are for movement in X, Y, and Z. The last three letters are for rotation about X, Y, and Z. The F stands for fixed and the R stands for released. So our pin is fixed in X, Y, and Z, and it cannot move. The pin can rotate about the Y and about the Z axis. We can also add a restraint for node 2. We want node 2 to be a roller, so the beam can move left and right. To show our node restraints, we can click this button. We can now see the pin and the roller. Now we can analyze our model. We can click on Analysis, then Linear Static Analysis. There are many settings that we can change, but for this model we can just click OK. The calculation is complete. To see our reactions, we can click this button. A 7.5 kilonewton force pushes up at each reaction. These values are correct. You can see from the forces. We must always check if the model has the right values. It is easy to make mistakes when building the model. We must be careful when we have the result. We can see the other forces in the beam. The shear can be seen when we click this button. We can change the size of the shear diagram by holding S and moving the mouse wheel. 
the bending moment can be seen when we click this button. We can change the size by holding the M key and moving the mouse wheel. We can also see the stress in the beam. We can click this button, then member stresses and bending stress at top. The steel in the top of the beam is stressed to almost 60 megapascals, but the yield stress of the steel is 300 megapascals. So this beam is strong enough. We have now covered the basics of space gas. We are ready to make more complex models in the next video.